Olympic Park and of course the heats were conducted last Monday night. We'll take a look at all the action from this week, commencing with the first league from Olympic Park last Monday evening. And the favourite here was Miss Sing Lee from Box 4. Your commentator is Ron Hawkswell. This time, Fantastico slow to begin. One of the first out to be out wide. Going quickly, Miss Sing Lee checked after the start. Born as Shamrock is a clear last as they drive into the first turn. Where to been showed out about three in front of Rio Vista running second. Three lengths away, third is Miss Sing Lee racing very wide. Knockout was checked there, followed by Fantastico. Then Knight's reward about four lengths away to face to face and Born to Shamrock. Last of all, they swing to the back 300 to travel to been the leader. Rio Vista the challenger on the outside and five lengths away came Miss Sing Lee followed by Knight's Reward, Fantastico. Over on the inside, a length or so to knock out and well back born is Shamrock. Face to face but travelling to the turn, 100 to travel. Rio Vista skipped away, three in front. Miss Sing Lee is coming hard now down the outside. Miss Sing Lee wearing the leader down close. Miss Sing Lee, the outside of Rio Racing Currency. In the second Lass league, the favourite well, Currency Lass, Lass Box 1. At four. Going quickly, Pomona Chief racing for the early lead. Currency Lass there on the outside and Regent Lad got a bump on the first turn and dropped a second last. Down the back, Pomona Chief, the leader, tackled by Currency Lass. Two lengths away then came Rocky James, Timothy 2. Further back is Vibrant Dream at Thames Progress. National Puppy second last and Regent Lad last. Travelling to the turn, Currency Lass goes through on the inside. Joins Pomona Chief, then Rocky James, Currency Lass kicked away the favourites home currency last wins it well two and a half lengths in a photo Pomona Chief sack the Olympic Park double from Monday night on the numbers eight and one returning a dividend of seven dollars thirty to Sandown Park on Thursday night in the first leg race two the favourite Rocky James from box one Rip Iron Man instant recall. Racing Rocky James away well. Over on the inside beginning smartly. Riviera Tiger goes straight to the lead and uh, in the run down the straight the first time. It's Riviera again charging to the lead out of the straight and leading it coming around the outside as instant recall. Going down the back straight and instant recall takes the lead. Riviera again running second. Rocky James clear on the outside. Summer down Toby is on the rails followed further back then by Rupper's Papa then came Noble Rip and well back then came a Ryan Man around the turn though. This is clear instant recall. It's Tracking out past the set, but it's two good wins by two and a half. Second summer down, Toby Rumpler's Papa third. Ready. Big run by the favourite Proud Paul forward, from box two in the second leg. Start last on settling down. Going quickly, win for West with Michael Tarner. Proud Paul's last on the rails, turning out of the straight. And as they run to the back straight, and Michael Tarner zipped away about four lengths in front of after gold. They were followed by Proud Paul going through on the inside. Then came win for West, followed by Sheila's Rocky. And last of all, coming off the back straight as Railway Bill. Michael Tarner's a mile in front, six in front of Proud Paul coming after it, followed by Sheila's Rocky. Michael Tarner, the leader. Proud Paul cutting it down the favourite, grabbed the lead and got up to win. Proud Paul first, Sheila's Rocky second, Michael Tarner third. You needed the numbers eight and two for the daily double at Sandown on Thursday night for a dividend of $6.60. To Geelong now on Friday night and in the first leg of the double race two, the favourite propellant from box six. And they're racing. Darvigo jumped away with them. Going away smartly, though. New Milford is going to the lead. And New, New Milford led about three lengths. There's Darvigo, the favourite now. Up running second on the first turn. Going to the outside. Then Blue Midnight. Severe trouble towards the rear. Lady Zap was checked and so is Miss Bo Gem. Down the back straight and New Milford the leader. A length or so to Darvigo looking for the rails and five lengths to Blue Midnight. Well back then came. Come on, turn around. Drop off followed by Lady Zap. Real sunshine. Darvigo shot through on the inside. Took the lead now and the favourite is coming away. Darvigo. Darvigo down to the post about two lengths to Blue Midnight. Third home is New Milford followed by Ann Dropoff. That was Cranbourne last night. The first leg in the second leg. The favourite flying fast from box three. Driven straight to the lead. Tangletown running second was checked to the outside and riding up to be third is cutting loose out of the straight and flying fast at burst clear now. About three or four in front. Tangletown around the outside and then cutting loose. Three lengths further back is Perfect Cheek from Selshura. Lytton's Fortuna read a post and Dunmato's image but flying fast is going great guns on the home turn. About four lengths in front of Tangletown and then cutting loose but it's the favourite daily Double home, flying fast, wins easily by three and a half lengths to Tangletown, cutting loose third. Well, it was such a popular double, we thought we'd let you have a look at that one first. One and three at Cranbourne last night, and the dividend $2.20. Let's turn back the hands of time and go to Geelong, and uh, as I said, propellant the favourite in the first league from box six.
Racing this time, Hooded Bandit slow to begin, so is Colebrook Lad. Boxing away well there near the inside was Made of Belfast. Zipping around them, Pomona's Tigress has gone straight to the lead though. Diamond Tempex out in the clear on the outside is finishing well. Followed by Propellant in the centre, then Made of Belfast. Eight lengths away came Sajuna Hooded Bandit. Colebrook Lad, a new product on the turn though. And Pomona's Tigress clear. Coming down the outside is Propellant now. Pomona's Tigress the leader and wins. A half length, second is Propellant. Two lengths away, third dive. And Tebix from Made of Belfast. In the second leg, equal favourites, Busy Stroller and We Rua. Chief Babwe is up there racing for the lead and so is We Rua the outside. Chief Babwe by two lengths going to the back straight now from We Rua. Busy Stroller third was checked to the outside and Miss Naomi was also checked at that point but they run to the back straight and Chief Babwe's only about two lengths in front. We Rua looked the big danger, they've raced away ten to Busy Stroller. Then came Beauty Action followed by Zachariah Jetta's Kingdom and last of all Miss Naomi coming off the back straight. It's still Chief Babwe by two to two and a half lengths. We Rua running second a dozen lengths away to Busy Stroller. Then Beauty Action. Zachariah nearing the turn and We Rua going through on the inside of Chief Babwe. Chief Babwe the outside grabbed by We Rua the inside. We Rua Chief Babwe go to the line and We Rua's one about a head to Chief Babwe. About eight lengths away third is Busy Stroller. And the Geelong Double on Friday night on the combination eight and five returned a dividend of ten dollars and forty five cents. And of course a big week coming up in Greyhound Racing with the big race the Dunlop Olympic tyre sprint tomorrow night at Olympic Park. We'll take a break and look at harness racing as it reverted back to Saturday night at Mooney.